Hello everyone, I'm Major Vel. welcome to my channel. Today I show you how to make this beautiful tulle dress. Bring 8 layers of tulle. It has 3 buttons on the back. Here the front. The size is for a two-year-old girl. I leave you a table of approximate measurements so you can make it bigger or smaller. In my blog I leave you a small graphic pattern. I hope you liked it. Materials 100 grams of pink thread, hook 3 millimeters. Two pieces of tulle of 160 centimeters per 200 centimeters. Scissors, three buttons, sewing needles, thread color of the fabric. We fold the fabric in one rectangle of eight layers of tulle, 80 centimeters or 31.5 inches. 50 centimeters or 19.6 inches long. We make two rectangles. Take the measurement of the waist. You need double the measure for the fabric. You will have to join the two rectangles. You have to pucker the two rectangles of the tulle fabric until you have the measurement of the contour of the waist. Then we sew everything to the yoke. It's very easy to do. Later I'll explain more. We started with 90 chains. One round. Three chains. Fourteen double crochet. The stitch is multiple of three. Two chains. One double crochet in the same stitch. Seventeen doubles crochet. This part will be the sleeve. Two chains. One double crochet in the same stitch. 23 doubles crochet. This part will be the front. Two chains. One double crochet in the same stitch. 17 doubles crochet. This part will be the sleeve. Two chains. One double crochet in the same stitch. Fourteen double crochet. This part will be your back. The back is half of the front plus three double crochet in each part. What is the clip?
I'm not going to make buttons. I use some very small buttons and I do not need them. But if you need it, they do sir. You just have to make a chain and skip one stitch. And that's how you can make a buttonhole. Undo the chain mat. Two round. One chain. Three single crochet. Three chains. Skip three stitch. One 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 single crochet. Now we have reached the corner. We always do the same. Three chains. One single crochet. Three chains. Skip three stitch. 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 One single crochet. Now we have reached the corner. We always do the same. Three chains. One single crochet. Three chains. Skip three stitch. One single crochet. Continue sequence until you reach the corner. Now we have reached the corner. We always do the same. One single crochet. Three chains. One single crochet. Three chains. Skip three stitch. One single crochet. Three chains. Skip three stitch. One single crochet. Continue sequence until you reach the corner. Now we have reached the corner. We always do the same. One single crochet. Three chains. One single crochet. Three chains. Skip three stitch. 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 Three single crochet.
three round one slip stitch two chains two double crochet where we have the three chains, three double crochet, where we have the three chains, three double crochet, where we have the three chains, three double crochet, where we have the three chains, three double crochet, Now we have reached the corner. We always do the same. Three double crochet. Two chains. Three double crochet. In the same stitch. where we have the three chains, three double crochet. Continue sequence until you reach the corner. Now we have reached the corner. We always do the same, three double crochet. two chains, three double crochet, in the same stitch, where we have the three chains, three double crochet, continue sequence until you reach the corner, now we have reached the corner, we always do the same, three double crochet two chains three double crochet in the same stitch where we have the three chains three double crochet Continue sequence until you reach the corner. Now we have reached the corner. We always do the same. Three double crochet. Two chains. Three double crochet. In the same stitch. where we have the three chains, three double crochet,
where we have the three chains, three double crochet. Continue sequence until the end of the round. Finish round with three double crochet. Round four, repeat round two. One chain, three single crochet. Three chains. Skip three stitch. One single crochet. Three chains. Skip 3 stitch, 1 single crochet, 3 chains, skip 3 stitch, 1 single crochet, 3 chains, skip 3 stitch, 1 single crochet, 3 chains, skip 3 stitch, now we have reached the corner. We always do the same. One single crochet. Three chains. One single crochet. We repeat round two and three until we have the necessary measure. I have worked it for 12 rounds. 9 cm or 3.5 inches from shoulder to armhole 12 cm or 5 inches now let's join the front with the back we start with the sequence of round 3 in the corner we also make 3 double crochet Skip the sleeve. In the corner we also make 3 double crochet. Continue sequence until you reach the corner. In the corner we also make 3 double crochet. Skip the sleeve. In the corner we also make 3 double crochet. Continue sequence until the end of the round. We join the yoke with slip stitch in the 3 double crochet. As seen in the image. One chain, one single crochet, three chains, one single crochet. We repeat the round two. When we reach the end of the round, we hook with single crochet. As seen in the image. Finish round with slip stitch.
We continue repeating round 3 and 2. We have lengthened to the waist. Let's do some peaks around. 3 chains. Three double crochet in the same stitch. In the single crochet of the previous round, one slip stitch, three chains. Three double crochet in the same stitch. In the single crochet of the previous round, one slip stitch, three chains, three double crochet in the same stitch. In the single crochet of the previous round, one slip stitch. We continue the sequence around the waist and sleeve. As I explained in the beginning, I have cut two rectangles of eight layers of tulle fabric. 80 cm wide by 50 cm, it all depends on the tulle fabric you buy. We make two rectangles. As you can see my fabric is very thin. I have not found another. We sew the two rectangles throughout. As seen in the image. Do not sew everything. to then be able to cut and leave it to your needs. Sew the two parts. I always do a puckered skirt. I have put twice as much cloth or a little more that the contour of the waist. To pucker you just have to pass the needle as you see in the image. So if you want it wide, So if you want it narrower,
You have to purse the two parts in width, but do not cut the thread and then stretch. Once you have the gathered skirt, let's join it with the yoke. Do not cut the shearing thread. Put a needle around so it does not move. On the other hand, equal. guided by the seams of the sides. Inside the dress, we will sew as seen in the image. You can also sew it out of the dress. I hope you liked it. Thank you very much for following me. Thank you very much for seeing me.